A miniature train railroad that had recent struggles with the city of Fort Worth is now right back on track. The Forest Park Miniature Railroad has been around for decades. And last year, after mechanical problems and deadlines from the city to take action, today the train back in business. Fox 4's Dion Anglin joining us with more. Dion. Hi there. Well, it is a complete reboot for Fort Worth's icon, the miniature train, and that includes a fresh new paint of coat, he, uh, coat of paint for the depot at Trinity Park. All aboard and all is back on track. What a great day this is that this thing is up and running now. It's been uh, a challenge. The iconic bright red and yellow miniature train in Fort Worth is once again chugging along for the first time in more than a year. Thank you to the city for giving us the time and, the, and, and, and being patient with us. We had some supply chain problems getting this back on track, no pun intended. Mary Talley's great-grandfather in the late 20s started what many now know as the Forest Park Miniature Train. Tally inherited shares in the attraction when her grandmother passed away. She did not become principal owner until recently, when the pandemic and other challenges derailed the attraction. A guest rider welcoming it back to service, former Mayor Betsy Price and her grandson, as well as current Mayor Maddie Parker. All of us have memories um, on this wonderful train track. I think that's why there's been so much media attention, is everyone in Fort Worth has some, some attachment to this amazing park, to Trinity Park, to being on this train. In November of last year, Fox 4 shared the train's dilemma when it sat idle for months and the city issued the operator a 60-day ultimatum to honor the terms of its long-standing contract. The trains were in, uh, needed of a facelift and these are the original 1972 CP Huntington's that my family purchased back, uh, back then and uh, there's just not a lot of CP Huntington's for sale, so we had to refurbish them, and we are working with some vendors right now to build some new engines. Fort Worth's legendary locomotive and the actual tracks, which run from the city zoo to Trinity Park and back, are ready to officially welcome riders once again beginning Friday. We have worked diligently to refurbish this 1972 CP Huntington. Our plan is to make the trains bigger and better than ever. Now, souvenirs and uh, concessions are something you're supposed to be able to jump off here and purchase at Trinity Park. And get this, we've come a long way since the 1920s. A new feature to debut tomorrow will be that credit cards are now accepted as a new payment method. It's the very latest live here in Fort Worth, Trinity Park. Steve Heather, back to you. Keeping up with the times. All right. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> Dion, thank you.